Alright, so first up we've got the app Free Notes, and if you haven't guessed already, it's an entirely free note-taking app meant to rival popular apps like GoodNotes and Notability. Given that it's free, it is lacking in some more advanced options that the paid note-taking apps have, like different sizes for highlighters or stickers, but honestly, you can just use any photos with a transparent background that you have and just add them into your notes, and overall, it's honestly a really great free note-taking app, and if you don't want to pay the increasing subscription costs of popular ones, I would definitely recommend checking out free notes. Next is Canva, which I 10 out of 10 recommend to anyone, and I mean anyone. I use it for my thumbnails for my videos, for the designs of my Notion template thumbnails on my storefront, for PowerPoint presentations for university. Seriously, if you have ever had to make a PowerPoint or a brochure or a resume, Canva is perfect since it's super user-friendly and they have so many templates to choose from. So next up, we have Jenny AI, the sponsor of this video, which is an AI-powered writing tool meant to revolutionize revolutionize the way essays are written. It's basically designed to be a time-saving and efficient writing assistant for students and professionals, and with its advanced AI capabilities, it can make the writing process way easier and also enhance the overall quality of your writing. Jenny AI features AI commands like AI autocomplete and sentence suggestions, where it basically finishes the sentence for you or offers entirely new ones based on what you've written. Jenny AI also helps you with citations, specifically in-text citations, by allowing you to search for citations and sources, generating citation suggestions of its own for relevant studies, and allowing you to cite an APA, MLA, IEEE, Chicago, or Harvard style. That way you don't have to constantly jump onto different websites to cite your sources and watch their ads while you're frantically trying to submit your essay last minute. <coughs> I've been there. Also, you can highlight any line or paragraph of text and press cite to open the citation manager and find relevant sources. Jenny AI even has an AI chat, which acts as a virtual assistant to answer any questions you may have while using the platform, and it even can summarize PDFs. So if you're confused about a specific paper or part of your textbook, the chat can help clarify things for you, summarize it, and explain concepts in simpler, easier to understand terms. On the right, you'll also see the research library where you can upload, manage, and easily cite publications and documents from your library, and even access Jenny AI's suggested scholarly articles and publications to enhance your understanding of the topic you're writing about. You can use use Jenny AI for free, but if you want to use its more advanced features, you can sign up for Jenny and use the code SS20 for 20% off. Next up is Hatch on the iPhone and Focus Plant on the Android, both of which aim to help you stay focused and track your time studying or working. Hatch is perfect for Pokemon or animal lovers since every time you start a time session and successfully finish it, there's a chance that you'll unlock a new adorable creature. And in Focus Plant, you get raindrops every time you complete a time study session so you can water your plants and grow your garden. So basically, both timer apps are just really fun ways to make studying and working into a game, and they're also free, lesser-known variations of popular apps like Forest or Study Bunny. Speaking of Study Bunny, it turns out that the same company that made Study Bunny also has another app called Habit Rabbit, which helps you keep track of your habits. Basically, whenever you complete a habit, you get energy points, which then allow you to clean your rabbit's messy room, unlock new furniture for your room, and eventually get access to other rooms in the house. The app also keeps track of how long your streak is for checking into the app and completing habits, has an internal timer, and even a place to write daily notes. Next up is the free website I Miss My Library, which is just a great ambient site to have on while you study, as you can customize which sounds are playing in the background and also make a task list for your study session. And last but certainly not least, we have Notion, one of my favorite apps and extensions of all time. Notion is an easy to use platform that allows you to plan, track, and do all of your work in one place. It has a template gallery with a bunch of templates so you can duplicate them into your workspace and you don't even have to build things yourself, like the template that I just released that you guys can use to track your habits, make to-do lists, organize your school life, etc. It also features things like buttons where you can automatically generate a list, databases that can help you track your finances or budget and add things up for you, and formulas that allow you to make progress bars for habits. Overall, I highly recommend it for any student or just professional out there, and it basically has everything you need, and it's also free, so I highly recommend checking it out.